Hello friends, today we are going to be finding a solution to the problem of why we cannot change emulator performance of AVD in Android Studio. The same problem we can tell in different way which is the emulator performance option is still disabled for me when I am creating emulator with Play Store device. Okay, I am going to be show you what is the problem, how we can fix this issue. Okay. Go back to the Android Studio, click on Device Manager, here click on Create Device, here we can see the list of devices available. First I am going to be Create Device which is Pixel 6 Pro without Play Store. First I am going to be Create the device without Play Store. Select this Pixel 6 Pro, click on Next. Here I am going to be Select Yes Release Version which is APA level 31. Click on next. Here you can see emulator performance, the graphics, it is enabled mode. If you want, you can able to change this uh, graphics. So here I'm going to be select this software GLES 2.0. Why I'm selecting this software GL, GLES 2.0? Already I explained in this video, please go through that. Okay, this is also one problem, how we can fix this terminator issue. I tell, uh, already I told the solution in this video. Okay, back to the Android Studio. Now I selected to software GLS 2.0. Okay, this is without Play Store. Click on finish. So now, I, we, we are created one device without Play Store, okay, which is uh, considered as Google API. Again, I'm going to be create another one device. Click on create device. Now I'm going to be create device with the Play Store. Here I'm going to be take Pixel 7 Pro, okay. Pixel 7 Pro, click on next. Here I'm going to be select the same version, which is yes, release, okay. Click on next. Here you can see the same S version, S release I selected. Anyhow, here you have seen the emulator performs the graphics it, it disabled mode. We cannot able to change any GLS uh, version, right? Click on finish. So now this is Play Store emulator. This is without Play Store emulator. So what is the difference between to emulator. So here if you want to uh, install any new applications whether WhatsApp or Facebook or Twitter or Amazon, uh, Flipkart, which application you want to automate, which application you want to practice the mobile automation, you can able to install through Play Store, right? If you have separate APK file without help of Play Store, if you want to install, then you can choose without Play Store emulator device, okay. Anyhow, I am preferring Play Store device. Let's see what is the issue I am facing. Now I created Play Store device. I try to open this one. Click on this play button. I am getting that Emulator process for AVD has terminated. This is the problem I'm getting. Click on OK. Close it. The same I'm trying to open without Play Store, which is Google API device, the first one. Or else we can rename it for easy to understand. Play Store 1. This is no Play Store. Okay, now I'm going to be launch this no Play Store device. It is launched successfully. We are not getting any issue which is the emulator process has terminated. That issue is we are not getting when I try to open no Play Store emulator. Okay, I'm going to be close this device. But the same, yes, release only. Anyhow, the Play Store device not able to open, right? So here what I will do. Uh, here, go to File Explorer, here, maximize it, 
this PC, go to C drive, users, select your username, username, here go to Android, go to AVD, here you can see two devices there, right, 6 Pro and 7 Pro, go to Play, uh, sorry, Android Studio, which device we could not able to open, Pixel 7 Pro, correct? So here, go to File Explorer, open Pixel 7 Pro API 31. Here you can find config file. You can open this config file. Little bit down, here you can see there is two options hw.gpu.enabled equal to yes, hw.gpu.mode equal to auto. This two option you have to change to on and off. Okay, sorry, no and off. So this enabled I have put as no. This gp mode I put as off. Save it. Open this Pixel 7 Pro Play Store 1 device. Let's see what will happen. Before when we are trying to open, before editing, it's not launching, right? We are getting terminated issue. So now we have seen after editing config file, which is the device has been launched successfully, correct? So close this one. Close this running device. Click on edit icon. Now you have seen after updating no and off in config file let's open that config file no and off right enabled no mode is off so after that we have seen the graphics has updated gls software gls 1.1 okay before it was automatic after editing config it was changed to software gls 1.1 okay click on finish if you want i can create another one device click on create device i have to select pixel 7 play store device select yes release click on next play store 2 here you can see defaultly the graphics has selected as automatic we could not be able to edit this one click on finish so this is the play store 2 device i try to open this device now we will get the device the emulator process has terminated this is the issue we are getting correct click on ok close this one go to file explorer user username android avd inside avd you can go to pixel 7 api 31 play store 2 this is the device just now we have created go inside open config file here you can see gpu dot enabled equal yes this is the auto one enabled is yes mode is auto this is the defaultly has been updated in config now it is yes now i'm going to be changed no gpu dot mode now it's auto i'm going to be changes off you can save this one control s after saving you just close this one i try to open confirm whether properly has updated or not it is updated as no and off Let's see the Play Store 2 device has launched or not. Click on play button. So before we are getting the emulator process has terminated, right? After updating config file, the Play Store device has launched successfully, right? I'm closing this device. Click on edit icon. We have to confirm. The emulator performance the graphics before automatic now it has changed to software GLS 1.1 okay so after updating to software GLS 
we can able to learn successfully okay click on finish again i open this play store to device i just want want to see the play store app this play store app available in this device